Hello everyone. In this video, I will show you how to fix the error message that says your account cannot be created at this time when trying to create a new Apple ID. If you're trying to create an Apple ID on your iPhone or iPad and this message keeps appearing, I'll walk you through several steps that can help solve the issue. Let's start with the first and most common fix. This issue can happen if your internet connection is slow or unstable. To check this, swipe down from the top right corner of your iPhone to open the control center. If you're connected to Wi-Fi and it's not working well, try switching to mobile data. Leave Wi-Fi off for a few minutes while you try to create your Apple ID. On the other hand, if you're using mobile data, try switching back to a fast and stable Wi-Fi connection. A poor internet connection can often cause the Apple ID creation process to fail. The second reason why you may see this error is if you're connected to a VPN. VPNs can sometimes interfere with Apple's servers because they hide your real IP address and change your location. To check this, open the Settings app on your iPhone. Scroll down and tap on VPN, which is usually located under the battery settings. If the VPN is turned on, tap to disconnect it. Then go back and try to create your Apple ID again without the VPN connected. The third fix is to check if your iPhone is running the latest version of iOS. To do this, go back to the Settings app and tap on General, then tap Software Update. If a new version of iOS is available, download and install it. Updating your software can fix bugs and errors that might be stopping you from creating an Apple account. Even if your phone seems to be working fine, staying updated can help avoid problems like this in the future. Next, go back to the General section in Settings and scroll down to find Date and Time. Tap on that and make sure the setting is turned on for Set Automatically. If the date and time on your phone are not correct or not synced to your time zone, it can cause issues when connecting to Apple's servers. Keeping this option on automatic makes sure your phone always stays in sync. If none of those steps worked, you can try resetting all your settings. To do this, open the Settings app, go to General, scroll all the way down and tap on Transfer or Reset iPhone. Then tap on Reset and select Reset all settings. This will not delete any of your personal data like photos or apps, but it will restore your system settings such as Wi-Fi networks, wallpapers and privacy preferences back to default. After doing this, you will need to reconnect to your Wi-Fi and set up things like Face ID or Touch ID again. Once you've done all of these steps, open a browser on your iPhone and go to applet.apple.com. Tap on the arrow or the sign in icon and then tap on Create Your Apple ID. Follow the steps by entering your personal information carefully, including your name, date of birth, email, and password. After that, follow the verification steps and you should now be able to create your Apple account without any problems. Thanks for watching.